What's up, everybody? Welcome back to The Upland Show. Today, we're looking at something kind of interesting. This is the price list for Spark. We all know Spark. Spark is the resource that helps you to develop properties and buildings within your or on top of your properties in Upland. And the price list. Big surprise. You can only buy Spark with USD. Like, can you, why can't you buy it with Upix? Like, I'm selling, I'm selling properties with Upix. I would love to just use some of that Upix instead of having to pour more USD into the game. Why can't I just use my Upix to buy Spark with that? It's interesting because the first time they sold the NFLPA legits, you could only buy those legits with uh, USD. With USD. And now they're now they're Spark uh, or now they're uh, Upix only that they you can buy it. legits with. They reversed it, so may, maybe they'll do the same with Spark. But tonight we do want to teach you how to buy Spark. Well, a roundabout way to earn Spark without having to pay USD for it. I would love to know that that secret, please. Yeah. So we're going to talk about treasure hunting. Uh, and this week is Spark Week. There's boosted treasure hunts starting on Thursday, November 18th at 9 a.m. So that's today. We're filming late at night. On Thursday, we'll be boosting the rewards for Spark found in treasure hunts. Boosted rewards will remain active through next weekend and will conclude at the end of Spark Week on Sunday, November 21st at 11.59 p.m. p.m. T Pacific time. So when they say next weekend, they're saying this weekend. Well, it's because they uh, they released this article uh, okay. on November twelfth. Gotcha. Okay. So um, it's bad stay tuned for yeah. It is kind of weird. They said <laughs> next weekend when they said Sorry. starting on Thursday. I'm an editorial. Stay guy, tuned for more details on Boosted Spark treasures. Okay. So there's more. Cool. First of all, there's more Boosted Spark treasures to come. Right on. Which is cool. Yeah. Boosted Spark Treasures are here right now. Um, this is your chance to earn some Spark. I think Spark is a super valuable resource. Uh, because Spark is, the again, is the, the resource or the gas or whatever it is that helps you to build pro uh, like buildings, structures yep. on top of your property. You stake right? Spark in order to build. build. And how much Spark is staked is how fast a building is being built. Okay, philosophical question for you. Yeah. Do we know that having a, um, a, a structure on top of a property brings more value to the that property yet? Uh, like why would I want Spark? Currently the community has kind of collectively said, we believe in the future value of Spark and therefore they've set there's even some people who've gone out and said, this property takes this many spark hours to build, therefore it's worth this much. And I believe the minimum is like any built any property with a building on it should currently be worth like forty thousand upix minimum. You know, be nice. Is and so if, if you could buy five dollar properties and put a building on it, the right. smallest building, and sell that for forty thousand upix, that's an increase that the community is kind of going by right now. I think, personally, this is just me, okay, but I think that if Upland the game were to, uh, when they released new minted properties, new, a, a new city, if they had some of those properties, like maybe some of the collections maybe or whatever, if they already came equipped with buildings already on them that, an rep interesting that, idea. that replicated whatever the real life thing is, I think... Dude, landmarks. Yeah, Landmarks exactly. should already have the landmark that's on it. That's what I'm dude. saying. So that's when that's already there, and you buy that, and they price, they establish the floor price for that mint new property, that new minted property with that property structure on there, with the structure built, as higher because the structure's there. Now that starts to trickle down into the game, such that as players, when they build new properties it has so economic benefit one thing that's interesting that the upland team has done and a reason i think they won't do that necessarily have a building have a building pre-built on yeah. a property is even nflpa who's coming to the game upland has partnered with the nfl right. on this to get to build stadiums in various cities right um they're making 
they gave them a certain amount of spark, and they have to stake spark to build the stadium. Who's they? NFLPA. Oh, and wow. The NFL, yeah, the, the organization. The they organization. <laughs> they're not just going to create the stadium. Because yeah, they're like, sense. we believe it. Because Upland team has come out and said, we believe even we have to follow the rules gotcha. of building that we've established in the metaverse. Which you could take either way. Be like, why didn't they just do that? Or you could be like, that's cool. They're following yeah. a set of rules, governance yeah, that, is that cool. the that metaverse is, cool. is run that. by. I wish, though. And like, they're even making third party yeah businesses follow the same rule set yeah that makes sense there's no shortcut in it i could just see the cool value of i'm thinking of cleveland okay now imagine remember cleveland yep cleveland had a couple of properties that everybody wanted one was the um uh the house that was the film that was used in the film the christmas story yep with the fragile leg in the window fragile so imagine though if that house like you come to that property and it already has the leg yeah the leg is sitting there yeah and then like when you click on that building like like we all know the user interface of upland and when you get down there and you see the blue property or the green property that says that this is something you could buy or it's mint green means you can mint this and there's the building Let's go there. to that if you were to click on that building wouldn't it be cool if Actually all of a sudden that the is. screen changed such that now you're inside of the fragile i bought a bunch of property right next to fragile dude uh how'd you get there so fast like how'd you because i know where it's at yeah this is it this is it right here oh it's in tremont it's, uh, it's up here Christmas story house. That's it. One of them's a parking lot, though. Like yeah, that got, one's the parking. Gypped. Look, it's yeah. a landmark. Dude, it is. Bro. Do you own this? No way. Do you own this? They're making it a land. I didn't know this Do yet. Do you own it, though? No, look. It hasn't been sold yet. Oh. They are going to make it into what you're saying right now, dude. Wow. It's a landmark that nobody owns yet. They're going to, dude. Okay, so what is They're going to sell it at Christmas. Oh, my oh, gosh, dude. dude. That's the, probably what oh, they are going to do. My, dude, what if they do a giveaway for this, bro? Dude, okay, Holy so. Holy freaking fragile, All right, dude. So, everybody who's listening to this right now, just make note that probably sometime during Christmas time this year, which is what, six weeks away? Yeah. Christmas story dude, house, y'all. Saving up these Upix mother effer, dude. That's oh gonna, dude. That's gosh. gonna be like t- at least two million Upix. No, I'll bet it'll be, I'll bet it'll be seven point five million. You think so? Yeah. Starting price. What? Dude, I'm gonna save that, up. I don't have dude. that much Upix right now. Oh my god. I'm telling gosh. you right now, I'm broke. That's cool, dude. Dude, I wonder how many other than. I didn't know it was a landmark. Bro. How many of the landmark properties are there available? There's a lot that are coming. Dude. But, uh, dude, one thing I wish... So, I bought a landmark property, okay? Uh, for those of you who don't know, I own Yoshi's in Oakland. Right. It's, or, why did you say Oakland? Oakland. <laughs> Oakland, yeah. <laughs> uh, Oakland's cool. Though, it's man. like I'm reading it in my head as I'm saying it. I know it's Oakland. Okay, Yoshi's. But, dude, I can't build... Dude. I still can't construct my building on it, dude. Wait, property development will be available for property develop development will be available for this property soon. The the game still hasn't built my 3D property and put it here for me to start building it. I bought it like a few months ago. Like I want to start building it. Yeah. So that is my one critique. Yeah. It's like, dude, if you're gonna make landmark properties right. and someone buys it, have it have the building made before you sell the landmark property. Yeah. And maybe even show what it will look like before people buy it. Okay, so I know we've talked... Dude, the, the other thing... Sorry to cut you off. No, you're good. The size of Coit Tower, dude. <laughs> Bro. The size of the Coit Tower, a little freaking landmark, Who dude. owns this, by the way? Uh, Fu Manku, dude. How do you buy that? Dude? Bro, dude, it's just tiny, bro. It's smaller. Yeah, that does look tiny. Dude, look. Look at this apartment building, <laughs> like next to it. Dude. Look at that. Like it's literally smaller. Like, dude. I live in that building right that next to Coit be Tower. Literally that dwarfs co- the Coit Tower. The circle of Coit Tower should be at least like this. Yeah. 
Yeah, like right now on my screen, scale. it's like the size of a dime. It should be at least a quarter. Sure. Come on. Silver dollar, whatever. Please, I don't know if the Upland team can change that because it's already being built, but come on, give them some if girth. Fu Manku's like, word, word, dude, how am I going to sell that? I paid <laughs> $25,000 for it. How am I going to get 50000 all right, so question then, if the Christmas Story house has not been announced as a, uh, what do you call it? A, a landmark. Like landmark. It, how did I know it's a landmark? Well, we, we just saw that now by looking at it, but how were we to know that if we hadn't gone to v physically visit it as we just did? I don't think you would, dude. I well, why not? Why would they just let you know that? Because they, I'm, it's make, fun, make dude. We just solved the puzzle, dude. Uh, you ever seen, dude, I don't think you've ever watched the whole entire film of Ready Player One. No, I have not. I've seen but, pieces of it. Uh, one of the things is the guy go, one of like the very, uh, like the main plot is he has to find, there's an Easter egg in the game, in the metaverse that the player has to go in and like find hints and figure it out and oh, solve cool. it. Very cool. It's almost like there's a puzzle within this. It's like a Harry Potter, but in a metaverse kind of thing. Dude, what is this song, bro? <laughs> I need a. Wait, is that mint green or right? dark green? Is that property for sale right next to the Fragile House? Yeah, it's for sale. Is it? No, like, uh, like yeah, someone it's for it. sale. How much is it? Oh, that's still a pretty. That's not bad, price. actually, dude. Okay, that's how you know it's a landmark. That little. Uh, icon right okay. there and they even so, named it christmas story house all right in the third party tools is there a search feature that allows you to search for landmarks that are yet not owned um i don't think there's a no okay all right my bad i feel like i'm we sure upix world will work on that yeah so. so i feel like we have really digressed we were going to talk about the treasure the, uh, treasure hunting right and i am the one who got us off topic, okay so, so 12 minutes in we're going to start treasure hunting <laughs> sorry 12 minutes for those of you who are still here i will give you one of my cheapest properties just let me know who you are and i'll give it to you don't say that dude no. take it back right now i will take it you'll back. get like at least a hundred of those. <laughs> Dude. They'll be like, McSqueeb didn't answer my Discord message. <laughs> oh, God. All right, we're gonna teach you how to treasure hunt, uh, and we're gonna we're gonna be in Chicago. Yeah. All right. I don't oh, think McSqueeb has ever treasure hunted. No, I've not. I have okay. not. But I own so a lot of Chicago. We're gonna try to treasure hunt until we get our first spark. So I want you to like. Ask questions about treasure okay. hunting. How does it work? I'll do that. Kay. As you're doing that, let me just tell this really quick story. I was just in Chicago two weeks ago for a uh, company meeting. And uh, when there was a slow moment one evening, I took an Uber from where I was located. I think you uh, told this story on a previous show. Did I? That you bought a building of a place you visited. Did I really tell Yeah, you told story? that. <laughs> All right, my bad. So sorry. I have an old man's brain that doesn't uh, always remember things. But oh shoot, my code. The name of the place that I went and visited was Delilah's. It was a it's the coolest bar in uh in Chicago. Um it's in downtown Chicago. It's called Delilah's and it's a punk rock bar. Meaning that when you go in there most most nights there's a band playing punk rock music, live punk rock mu punk music. Um, if not, you can just chill in there and uh, listen to uh, punk, you know? Dude, that's cool. It's super cool. And it's not like punk, like like pop punk from like 2005, like like Blink-182, which I Maybe love. Maybe we'll Blink find treasure at Delilah's tonight, dude. Delilah's is, dude. Maybe I, we'll f what Delilah's if we find legit. Spark tonight? At the building you own, Let's it'll be McSqueeb, and we'll uh, find Spark there. What would the chances be of that? That would be amazing. I'm just telling you, if you're ever in Chicago, go to Delilah's. It is one of the coolest spots you'll ever go to. It's a dive bar, but punk music, man. It's All right, bar. so the first thing you want to do is click on a property that you're next to. You can see I sent to that. Yep. All right, and you Kay. click treasure. This is like toggling the treasure feature on and off. You can see when I click it off, when I click it on, it says all treasures are recharging. Okay. Okay. So it has to be a building you're next to. Sorry, I'm just kind of giving a run through of how this works. Okay. Now you want to go and you want to click the, where is it? Treasures button. 
and I'm going to spawn my free one. What does that mean? So every day you get to spawn a treasure for free. Every day in the game. No every day what. in the game. You can do one free treasure hunt. Really? Yep. So I'll spawn my free one. And I can earn up to 230 to 6,600 Upix from the treasure chest that I find. Or Spark. <laughs> All right. So let's spawn That's our awesome. first treasure and we will teach you how to treasure hunt. Yeah, it's best. Cool. We're, I, I'm not the best at it, honestly. I haven't done it too. Okay. So see this? Thing? See right. this thing's pointing? That's cool. Yeah. I have like five minutes or whatever to find it. I'm not sure how much time Wait, I have. What, what, find what? What are you talking about? Okay, the treasure. So see, it's pointing kind of slow, like this circle. Is it saying X marks the spot right there, yeah, or is it saying no, it's in that it's direction? Po it's pointing in that direction. Okay. Which, by the way, how it's turned. So I have four minutes and 30 seconds to find it. <laughs> okay. So I think. Wait, could it be why like. Why is it turning the screen? Could it be like 6,000 miles away? Oh, dude, away? it's because you got to have it lined up properly north. All right, First of all, you got to have it lined up. When Okay, let's say you're in Oakland. Let's look at it again. Hold on. Dude, I I am way better on this on a phone. I'm just going to buy this property. When you have Hopefully we find our first one in 4 minutes and When you have 30 100 seconds. billion upics, it's fine to just like randomly buy properties just so you can conveniently navigate. Uh, hey, I want to have the most robust treasure <laughs> treasure map. Okay, we're down to 3. Okay, so it's pointing that way. Okay, and it's going kind of slow. Okay, you, you'll see it'll speed up. Hold up, hold up. Let's teach him how to treasure hunt for a sec. Uh, let's go up this direction where it was pointing. Mm -hmm. Okay, and if you send to your property, this is why you want to have a lot of properties. It doesn't cost a send, yeah. and there's no send fee. Right. So this is why you want to build at least probably get one. Okay, see, it's, see it's, uh, the circles are okay. going a little faster. Okay. So I didn't go up high enough. Okay. So let's go up higher. Let's go up like right here. The, the treasure is north. Okay, and That's if you helpful. click this, if you click your uh, yeah. chest piece, you can zoom back in. All right, cool. Okay, okay, I went too far. Way too far. Wait, did it go People down? are going to be making fun of me. No, they're not. Yeah, they are. Dude, did you see how far he overcorrected? <laughs> what a... <laughs> Idiot oil dude, oil. If anyone makes fun of you for that, like they, they, you really need to go live. Dude, people are hard. Dude, some people can get treasure in like three clicks, three properties well, every great, time. Great for them, dude. Like there are people who can like really uh, like do an amazing kickflip. What on is that? It's a different kind of treasure. Oh look, there's two arrows. Yeah, this is. I'm gonna get my treasure though. That's because a different one started. Okay, I'm the blue one. Let's go to McKinley Park. People are gonna be like. <laughs> Oil Doyle can't figure it out. You're doing it, dude. You're crushing dude, it. You're an executive. Well, imagine in this game. if we run out of time. You're a chief on operating the first officer form. or whatever you are. Chief executive. Chief executive. Dude, I'm it's going executive. slow, dude. What do you mean? Do you see how the like the circles around the arrow are going kind of slow? I yeah, way sure. overcorrected. Wait, the circles get, mean something? Yeah, yeah, watch. You'll see what I mean, because it'll get faster. Holy crap. A minute 44. <laughs> Coming Pressure's down on. to the wire. Pressure's on. Okay, see it speeding up? Okay. Does that mean see you're getting closer? Are going yeah, I mean, it's, it's, like, it's like playing a game of hot and cold. Okay. So the faster Treasure. the rings oscillate or whatever, or vibrate or whatever they're doing. Exactly. Yeah. Why are you, it's like a small child singing to us as we're doing this. Yeah, let's skip that song. Kind of creepy. I don't know what this playlist is. All right. Okay, I went too far. <laughs> so it's back up a little, see? And this like, is good. This is fun. And I was here, so it's like right in the middle of these. It's like, I'm going to guess so right send here. send it to something. Actually, we use a send. Yeah, so I'm going to use a send. This one... You have 21 cents. Dude, they up the limit of cents? No, I just have collected a lot from I thought you could only events. have like 11. They give you more. Okay, look at that. See, it's kind of red. It's turning red. Oh, so you're getting hotter. Okay, cool. And we got 40 seconds to oh get this gosh, thing. Oh my gosh, this is starting to stress me out. I know. Let's go like this right here. This is hardcore. People are like, <laughs> 
Oh, look. How close I am. Oh, my gosh, dude. Go. So let's just go like here. You got 20 seconds left. Come on, dude. I've had to use two. You can't click it too fast. Oh, oh, it's right there. Oh, I got it. I got it. Oh, what? With How'd 12 you get it? seconds left because my block explorer was close enough. The sword of Laban. 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 <laughs> <laughs> All right, so what's in there, dude? So you got a bunch of uh, epics. It'll How be much? epics, probably. Nice work. Thank you. Hey, 230. Right. You got, <laughs> got 2.3 cents. That's awesome. No, that's, 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 that's cool. Because, like, you can use that for something. So how much do we pay to go to this one? Dude, what? where are send fees? Where's the send fee? Is there a send fee? Yeah. 55 epics right here. So you see this? Oh, sure, yeah. You if you want to be super frugal about it, you could, like, click around and look for... So I spent 55 to send to one and then maybe, like, 40 to send to another. I think we only had to send to three properties and we gained 230. Yeah, I think we made bad. money there. Yeah, for sure. Okay, but this time, look at this. So we're going to spawn another treasure. Okay. Why this time spawn? we have to pay 100 upics. So we're always 100 upics already in the hole, which means the minimum we're going to get is 230. Yeah. Which means we don't want to pay more than 130 upics to find this treasure and sense and that's why you want to own a lot of your own properties in the city or just don't do yeah but dude this is a legitimate way to earn spark and earn money from your spark all right dude the music is killing me tonight <laughs> dude <laughs> okay here we go i got a new one all right <laughs> porty coon porty coon uh okay <laughs> where do people come up with these names Let's go this way. I Should got I one call over myself here. Porty Con? Pooty Con? No. Porty Coon. Okay. So right. we got 130 to spend. We haven't spent any because we sent to our own and we didn't have to use a send. Nice. Very smooth. Okay. Down the... Oh, we're getting close. Uh, are we? Okay. Somewhat cl we're closer. We're closer than we were. Okay. It's always good to be closer than when we were. All right. I'm going to guess. Far? You can go that see, far? See, I don't... I'm going to guess like right in here. Okay, you're gonna spend some money and buy send. Should I buy that property? <laughs> Whoa! That's expensive, bro. Don't do it. What is this like a fancy neighborhood? Avalon Park, bro. Everyone loves Avalon Park. Let's look what's for sale here. I'll That's buy this cheap. one. That's cheap. That's right. We buy. <laughs> we pay money. We spend six thousand upics to get that two hundred upics. No, but I own the property. I know you do forever from here on out. I'm building out my treasure hunting map so that love next it. time I won't have to spend money to go to that neighborhood. Love it, love it, love it. You all got right. How many more minutes do you have left? Oh, we're good, dude. You got three minutes left. All right, this is good, man. Dude, I hope you get I some cool spark. I know it's over spark. here, dude. I hope you get some good spark. I know spark. it's like right, let's guess, like right here. 25 opics was all for that one. This song's way better. Do you mean that genuinely? I do, Okay, actually. we're getting close. Oh, nice. It's turning red. Okay, so let's try to guess how many blocks it is. See how it's still kind of pinkish? One and a half. One it's got a, a pinkish blocks. hue. Oh, but it's not red. So it's not like really dark red. So it's maybe like, it's maybe at the end of the Painted Ladies here. Oh, I didn't it's see It's the, the same guy as the last one. That guy. He's Digital a, Zen owns this whole neighborhood. He's a tycoon. The Digital Zen tycoon. Dude, what if it's actually Donald Trump in this game? No way, dude. We didn't go far enough at all. It's not even dark red. Do you think there's any celebrities in this game? For sure. You think so? Yeah. Like, besides football players? Let's do it again. 40 epics. I'm spending all my stupid epics trying to get <laughs> spark. <laughs> it's for the illustration of the podcast. It's fine. Okay, dark red. See, uh, see that? Yep, it's like, yep, 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 yep. Okay, but get this. Yeah, you can maybe click on this one, and then it's str oh, showing straight across. Okay, that's helpful. So you can click like a few around yeah, it that's that cool. you're close enough to. And oh, see look at oh, this. Oh, dude, it's like probably crazy. And watch this. It's oh, going it's above nuts, that dude. One. It's going nuts. It wants it's you. It's above that one. It really wants you to have this. That's the one. It's on that property. Oh, cool. All right. That's good to know. 
All right, dude. Let's hope you got some spark in here. But if you get within like three properties, it'll give it to you. Well, that's cool. Probably nice work. The work. The work was nice. All right, so you've got okay, nice two hundred thirty. Very nice. Freak, we're out getting. All right, this one we're getting lucky. We're getting spark or a higher reward. It. It's like than Vegas baby. Vegas baby. Vegas baby. All right, here we go. We're not gonna stop till we at least get spark once. Could be here all night, folks. <laughs> Although they're not. <laughs> they're like, I'm done. <laughs> Just kidding. I know you're all tuned in because this oh, show they're fucking tuned. Rock, freaking rocks. They'll know we found it when the episode ends. They can yeah. just skip to that part. That's true. Don't see, do how, see how slow that was going? That was like, I'm going yeah, way I'm offensive. going way up here. Yeah. It was offensive how slow it was. The best thing about tonight, though, is we found out that the uh, Christmas Story house is a landmark. Dude. Are you gonna you're gonna go for that? I'm going for that 100 billion percent. Do you dude. think they're gonna let you know? When that, is that Although a they have Day? released that the size of the property is gonna matter in the. It's a small property, bro. The I it's know. Not like the it's size not like of the property is gonna matter on the re. So it's actually not worth 7.5. That one's no. probably worth five. But really from five? a collect from a collector's standpoint, yeah, five five million epics. That's five thousand dollars USD, dude. Yeah. Wow. But I think any landmark is worth that, dude. Just sure. for the collectors. Sure, sure, sure. I might try for it. Freaking I only have overcorrected again, bro. I only have one point six. I don't even know where I was. Okay. Big Nick's confident in his problem. Oh, we're getting close. It's happening. I can feel it. It's probably like right at the temple hey, of Christ. A, there it is. There's the temple of, of Christ. I'm s I'm going to the temple. DJ Shorts. That guy. He Shout out to DJ Shorts. That guy owns like 30% of this entire like metaverse. He does. He's a big boy. Okay. Uh. No, it's oh going to be God. at least. A lot of people are saying if there's a cent, let's, let's should we go to the next church? The next church? No, I'm going to think it's farther than that. But Instant Deliverance Church of God in Christ. <laughs> That's awesome. Instant, instant Deliverance. <laughs> Dude, I'm going to Instant Deliverance. How do you I not go to Instant Deliverance? I prefer my deliverance to be somewhat delayed. Not fully delayed, but not instant. That seems excessive. <laughs> Dude, instant salvation. Oh, I still want to live my we're life. We're so I, close. I may have weekend plans. Why would I want instant deliverance? That's no disrespect to the instant deliverance. We're so close. All right, let's go here. Worshippers and patrons. I'm going to skip a block just in case. Not far enough. There it is. Oh, you found it. Good for you, bro. 
Oh, was there. But Please. see, if you're one block away, it's fine. Please be Spark. I want my it's boy not to spark. spark. I think the Spark chest looks different. I've never got one. Yay, 230. Oh. You literally have now 690 Spark because of this exercise. Plus a video in the can. No, Plus. I don't, because I've lost money sending these properties. Oh, I've true. probably barely broke even, dude. <laughs> but, dude, you can win 6,600 from could. one chest. You could. No, yes. we'll, we'll get a bigger one for sure, dude. Wait, Watch. are we going to keep doing this? Yeah, bro. <laughs> <laughs> we got to get Spark or a bigger chest. Dude, I want to get Spark, dude. Yeah. We're hunting for Spark, bro. So for those I just of need you to get better at it. I suck at it. For those of you uplanders who are out there and have friends who have really all the infinite time on their hands um, and would like to spend... Bro, there are people who can probably get it in one minute every time. That's true. I know. Like, if you get really good at this, you're yeah. like, that many circles means that's approximately... So I'm going to count the blocks. Uh, you see these little grid blocks? Okay, we're going down the grid blocks. That's about yeah. 200 blocks. Yeah. I Dude, should be like, more attentive. And those people are amazing. There's for sure, like, someone who's like, that's, oh, a, 200, sure. that's a 200 block. And I'm sure they play D&D, &D, like, probably f six times a week, which is amazing because it's a cool game. I've never played it. I want to start playing it more. Dude, I've played. I've never played it. I've always heard it's cool. Dude, Stranger Things... It's all about the D&D. &D. All right, I'm buying this property because I didn't have one in this area. That's Whenever cheap. there's one to mint in yeah, an area cheap. that I'm sending to, I'm buying it. I'm building out a map of Chicago that's, like, unbeatable for treasure. Which city do Dude, you... Dude, the problem with Chicago is it's too, too freaking big. Yeah, it's huge. But it is a tier one city, so it's well, kind of like... How many... Okay, which city do you have uh, the highest percentage of properties? Probably owned? Chicago or Oakland. Okay, Oakland, yeah. Dude, I don't even, I'm not even paying attention to send. You had a lot in Manhattan, though, for a while, too, right? Yeah, but not that many. Manhattan's you know I really want? big boy business. You know what I really wish I had? See, if you click it too early, it won't show it. Damn, man. So you know. Okay. You Part know what I really wish I had, though? I wish I had the market share of Bakersfield. I've Who got a historic Bakersfield ultra rare baby. All right, let's go, to, let's go down here. I feel like Bakerfield is the most underrated city. I just want to see how close we are. Why is it underrated? Do you, you actually like Bakersfield? Uh, you, it's you, like... Is this satire? It is. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying Bakerfield, like... All right. The Kardashians live there. Kanye West has a house in Bakersfield. <laughs> um... I think Madonna. I didn't know Kanye West has a house in Bakersfield. <laughs> <laughs> Madonna has buy that property and send. She's on the second buy floor this. of an apartment in the complex there in Bakersfield. So that I don't have to use a send. That's like first world problems. I don't want to use a send, so I'm going to buy that <laughs> property. <laughs> That's so true, dude. <laughs> Way to keep it real. Because, like, you know there's people somewhere who are, like, worrying about where they're going to get their meal to feed their child. And I'm not making light of You're that like, one I'll bit. buy $6 on that digital property. <laughs> Screw it. <laughs> that makes me feel disgusted in myself. <laughs> That's All right, I got point. the treasure, dude. That's so sad. Donate this to somebody who needs a sandwich, dude. Dude. Just wait. We got some good news coming on the Upland Show. We're going to be doing some... Freak! Not anymore. Our charity just ran out. But in all reality, we are right now. I just want uh, I want a treasure box. Open up and can say you can now end this video and <laughs> go to sleep. <laughs> so just so you know, this is being published in the morning of uh, Thursday, November. No, we're gonna publish it on Friday. Friday, November eighteenth. But it is literally Friday. It's already Friday. It is Friday in our time zone, and it's. 2 a.m. I have a meeting in six hours. Just stay. Just pull an all-nighter, dude. Why not, dude? Let's make more minimal upics. All right. I keep overshooting it, and I think that's even an overshot. Let's go here first. I still think we should go to Bakersfield. Wait, how did you know the uh, treasure's all in Chicago? They're not all in Chicago. You could treasure hunting in any city. Any city. Okay. All right. So why'd you choose Chicago for tonight? Because you had a lot well, of Well, it's there? a tier one city. Yeah. 
first fall, and there's bigger rewards in tier one cities. Oh, okay, very nice. And the I tier one that. cities that's good information. Are San Francisco, Chicago, Manhattan. and Manhattan. The three. There's the only three. I think so. Could be wrong. I'm sure dude, we'll get a comment if I'm wrong. Gonna, dude, I only have like a million yeah. upics left. I should just buy. Okay, this is from this is from the riot. Bunch of people are going for that right now. What's the riot? What does that mean? Riot mode. There's riot mode. So that's one that you don't have to pay to spawn. That's one that because so many people are treasure hunting right now, the game just spawns one that there's probably bigger rewards in, but I'm like just trying to go for my own. I'll show you. Next time I go to click to create a new treasure, it'll say riot mode is charging or whatever. Freaking riot mode. Okay, so yeah, we no, overshot a little. All right, go ahead. Wait. Oh, that's BP. It's probably like right here on Wilcox Street. <laughs> Wilcox Street. Don't we all know? Only 20 Wilcox. epics to send. Well done. Good good man dame coin i'm buying this one that dame coin so much for saving up for the christmas story house ah oh, dude it's only five thousand upics four thousand eight hundred yeah you're, you're making money bro someone's gonna I'm come around money. and buy this for like at least six thousand upics all right so it's probably like That's not going to be enough. This is only 35 epics. Damn you, bird holdings. Dude, I'm su I am suck at this, dude. No, you don't. We've at least got them all. Speak positively about your upland self. Oh. <laughs> Let's click this one. Up, oh, still across the row. Okay. It's to be safe, go here because it will get it if it's above it. Got him. Strategy. Please, See, it'll please get it if I overshot by one block. Dude, when I started this video, I didn't need to shave. I now need to shave. Like, it's five o'clock somewhere. <laughs> hey, 500 <laughs> upics. Hey. <laughs> okay. So we're going to call it at that. That is That's how you beautiful. treasure hunt. But you're saying that some of these treasures have spark in them. They have spark. Which are Probably very valuable. Like, I heard one in 20. One oh, in okay. 20 chests will and have spark. And at the beginning of the video, we were looking at the sparks price list, and we saw that there's significant value to a spark or, you know, a fraction of spark. Dude, some people are earning, like, like almost a spark a week from that's treasure right. hunting, but they're probably spending a few hours a day. But still, that's like a 400, that's like, dude, that's like a $460 value, dude. Yeah. Look, 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 here's the thing. There are people out there who are making, you know, twelve dollars an hour at McDonald's. Why not spend two hours a day, right? Yeah. And make at least hunt for some spark. Eighty nine cents an hour. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> Why not? <laughs> Why not, dude? <laughs> or go work at Arby's. But no, no, seriously, four hundred sixty dollars a week would be legit, dude. Okay, but the value of spark like because rent. it's because there is not a lot of spark in the game of Upland, right? There's like the amount of players there are yeah. in the game, yeah, and how many s houses that are complete, yeah. There is a housing shortage in the game of there Upland really right now. Yeah, there really is. There's not enough completed People buildings for all the players to have. A virtual apartment yeah, in. Yeah, I'm with you. Or enough businesses to be. It's probably enough for businesses to be created. This is one of the reasons why I like Upland so much, is because, uh, you know, there really is true economics behind for sure. how they make their decisions. It's like Dirk, PhD like I, I love in that. economics. I love that. I love. I have a bachelor's degree in economics, and I was not smart enough to go beyond the bachelor's degree in economics. Because that's some hardcore crap, dude. Dude, I think he's genuinely is a is a smart economist who. Yeah. And that is what gives me. That is what makes me more bullish on Upland. Because Absolutely. Because like, which I makes do me see them making strategic moves for the economy. One of them. Yeah. Taking away that referral bonus that could generate. 
if someone puts in twenty five thousand dollars it generates twelve thousand five hundred dollars out of thin air that's yeah. that no longer exists it's too bad man the max is only fifty dollars from a referral bonus now wait for real yeah the max is the $50. max if you put in a hundred you can get fifty and if you put in ten thousand you get fifty fifty wow what a bummer that's a huge difference. Fifty thousand upics. Yeah, if you put in ten thousand dollars on a referral bonus, yeah. instead of getting five thousand dollars in upics, you get fifty. <laughs> what? Because they care about the economy, dude. Yeah, that is smart. So I like anyway, that. no, I like that it's very much. We hoped if you uh, searched diligently through this video, you could learn how to treasure hunt. Um, we hope to see you in the Absolutely. next one. Absolutely, and I apologize for my snarkiness. It's just a late night, you know? Yeah. It's and we know that this one was long form, but we wanted to actually go through the treasure hunting process, Absolutely. how it actually is. It's yep. not... I know we could put a little three-minute guide together that shows click here, click here, and then do this, and it looks really easy, but it, it takes some time. Yeah, and stay tuned because next week we'll talk about how you can spend four hours in one day I'm to earn about, out the episode, about 30 right? cents. <laughs> <laughs> just kidding. Love you all. No, for real. <laughs> Join the Glenview Building Project. Yes. Uh, there's a, there's a vi there's another video we released. Uh, dis discounted properties. Look for that one. Please do. That's what's on the thumbnail. And you can learn how to make good money from your spark from joining the Glenview Building Project. See, I want to do that for sure. That's see, that's how we create real money with spark. Anyway, we'll see you in the next one. Peace. See you.